I came from a storytelling family. Farewell, farewell. Oh, you're skipping verses. Well, I leave out the dull part. But this I tell to thee, thou wedding guest. They're coming closer together, which is a healthy thing. I mean, there was nobody more, more gorgeous than him. He's gonna be a big star. In the wake of a painful and messy divorce, the road to finding love again seemed like an uphill battle for Hollywood legend, Robert Redford. Yet against all odds, he emerged from the depths of heartbreak, his spirit unyielding, and his heart open to the possibility of rediscovered love. With resilience and unwavering determination, Redford embarked on a transformative journey of self-discovery and healing, ultimately leading him to an extraordinary love that would mend his wounded soul. Join us as we delve into the captivating narrative of Robert Redford's triumphant redemption, where love proved to be his greatest source of strength and renewal. Early Life Robert Redford, a renowned Hollywood star, had a remarkable journey that shaped the person we know today. Robert, born on August 18, 1936, grew up during the challenging times of the Great Depression. His family was not wealthy, and his father worked as a milkman while his mother took care of the children at home. Even as a young boy, Robert showed a talent for the arts. He loved storytelling and acting, and he often participated in school plays and local theater productions. These experiences helped him develop his skills and set the stage for his future success. After finishing high school in Los Angeles, Robert went to the University of Colorado Boulder. Initially, he studied geology, but his passion for acting led him to switch his major to drama. He learned from experienced teachers and honed his acting abilities. Robert's curiosity and desire for adventure took him to Europe in the 1950s. He explored the vibrant arts scene and gained exposure to different cultures, which influenced his artistic vision. When he returned to the United States, he headed to New York City, where he pursued a career in theater. In New York, Robert performed in off-Broadway shows and gradually gained recognition as a talented actor. In 1959, he had a breakthrough role in the Broadway play Tall Story, which earned him critical acclaim and caught the attention of Hollywood agents. Robert's entry into the film industry came in 1962, when he made his debut in the war drama War Hunt. His acting skills impressed audiences and paved the way for a successful career in movies. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, Robert Redford starred in many highly regarded films, showcasing his versatility and talent. He appeared in movies like The Candidate, a political drama, and Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid, a Western adventure. Audiences were captivated by his on-screen presence and the depth he brought to his roles. In 1973, Robert starred in The Sting, a film that solidified his status as a Hollywood legend. His collaboration with Paul Newman was a massive success, and the movie won several Academy Awards, including Best Picture. Besides acting, Robert also ventured into directing. In 1980, he directed his first film, Ordinary People, a heartfelt exploration of family dynamics. The movie resonated with viewers and earned him an Academy Award for Best Director. Beyond his work in the entertainment industry, Robert Redford became known for his commitment to environmental causes. In 1975, he founded the Sundance Institute, a non-profit organization supporting emerging filmmakers and artists. The Sundance Film Festival, which grew from this initiative, celebrates independent cinema and diverse voices. Robert Redford's remarkable journey from humble beginnings to Hollywood stardom serves as a testament to the power of talent, hard work, and determination. His story inspires us to pursue our passions, seize opportunities, and make a lasting impact on the world. From his childhood in California to his rise as an influential figure in the film industry, Robert Redford's path continues to inspire audiences and remind us that greatness is achievable with dedication and a love for storytelling, education, and early career. The key milestones that shaped Robert Redford's trajectory, from his formal education to the beginnings of his acting career. After graduating from Van Nuys High School in Los Angeles, Robert Redford pursued higher education at the University of Colorado Boulder. Initially, he chose to study geology, but his passion for the performing arts soon led him to switch his major to drama. 
Under the guidance of dedicated theater instructors, he honed his acting skills and developed a deep appreciation for the craft. Following his time in college, Redford's thirst for artistic exploration took him across the Atlantic to Europe in the 1950. Immersed in the vibrant art scene, he soaked up the rich cultural experiences that would later influence his work. The exposure to diverse perspectives and artistic expressions broadened his horizons, nurturing his creativity and shaping his artistic vision. Returning to the United States with newfound inspiration, Redford set his sights on the bustling entertainment hub of New York City. He fervently pursued a career in theater, initially taking on roles in off-Broadway productions. Through dedication and perseverance, he steadily made a name for himself as a talented and versatile actor, earning praise from both audiences and the theater community. In 1959, Redford's breakthrough in the theater world came with his role in the Broadway play Tall Story. His compelling performance drew critical acclaim, capturing the attention of Hollywood scouts who recognized his potential for on-screen success. This pivotal moment marked the transition from the stage to the silver screen, opening doors to a new chapter in his career. With his sights now set on the world of film, Redford made his cinematic debut in 1962 War Hunt, a war drama set during the Korean War. Although it was his first foray into movies, his natural talent and on-screen presence immediately captivated audiences, demonstrating his ability to seamlessly transition between mediums. As the 1960s and 70s unfolded, Redford's career gained consistent momentum, with a string of notable performances that showcased his versatility and depth as an actor. He took on a diverse range of roles, from the politically charged drama The Candidate to the beloved Western adventure Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid, solidifying his status as a versatile and bankable star. While his acting career flourished, Redford also explored his passion for directing. In the 1980s, he made his directorial debut with Ordinary People, a poignant exploration of family dynamics. The film resonated with audiences and critics alike, earning Redford an Academy Award for Best Director. This achievement further cemented his reputation as a multi-talented artist, capable of excelling both in front of and behind the camera. Robert Redford's educational background and early career experiences played a crucial role in shaping his journey to stardom. His decision to study drama in college provided the necessary foundation for him to develop his acting skills and discover his passion for the stage. His time in Europe expanded his horizons and enriched his artistic perspective, while his experiences in New York City's theater scene allowed him to refine his craft and gain recognition. As he transitioned into film, Redford seamlessly translated his talent and charisma to the silver screen, captivating audiences with his performances. Alongside his acting pursuits, he ventured into directing, further showcasing his artistic vision and establishing himself as a multifaceted force in the entertainment industry. The combination of his education, unwavering dedication, and early career choices propelled Robert Redford towards an enduring legacy as one of Hollywood's most beloved and influential figures. Awards and Honor Robert Redford has not only captured the hearts of audiences around the world, but has also been recognized for his immense contributions to the arts and society. From his directorial debut in Ordinary People, which earned him the prestigious Academy Award for Best Director in 1980, to receiving the Honorary Caesar at the 40 Fort Caesar Awards in Paris, Redford's talent and vision have garnered him numerous accolades. In 2017, the Golden Lion for Lifetime Achievement at the Venice Film Festival was bestowed upon Redford, honoring his remarkable body of work and his impact on the cinematic landscape. Throughout his career, he has been celebrated with honorary degrees from esteemed institutions such as the University of Colorado, Bard College, and Brown University, recognizing his contributions to the arts and his dedication to fostering creativity. The National Audubon Society presented Redford with its highest honor, the Audubon Medal, in 1989, acknowledging his commitment to environmental conservation. His passion for nature and advocacy for environmental causes have left an indelible mark, inspiring others to protect and cherish the world we inhabit. As a testament to his artistic and cultural influence, 
Redford was awarded the National Medal of Arts by President Bill Clinton in 1996. The following years brought further recognition, including being appointed Chevalier of the Legion d'Honneur by President Nicolas Sarkozy and receiving the Presidential Medal of Freedom from President Barack Obama. Redford's impact extends beyond the realm of entertainment. The Kennedy Center Honors acknowledged his profound contributions to American culture in 2005, while the Dorothy and Lillian Gish Prize celebrated his outstanding dedication to the arts and his ability to enrich the human experience. Not content with personal achievements alone, Redford has championed social responsibility, global awareness, and inspiring young minds. The Robert Redford Award for Engaged Artists, established by the University of Southern California School of Dramatic Arts, honors individuals who exemplify excellence in their craft while actively promoting social change and empowering the next generation. Robert Redford's journey is one that goes far beyond the silver screen. His awards and honors bear testament to his talent, artistry, and unwavering commitment to making a positive impact on the world. Through his work, he has not only entertained audiences but also inspired change, leaving a remarkable and enduring legacy. Sundance Institute Robert Redford's passion for supporting emerging artists and fostering independent filmmaking led him to establish the Sundance Institute. Let's delve into the origins and mission of this organization, which has become synonymous with creativity, innovation, and the celebration of diverse voices in the film industry. In 1975, Robert Redford founded the Sundance Institute, a non-profit organization dedicated to the development and support of independent filmmakers. The Institute takes its name from the Sundance Mountain Resort in Utah, a place that holds personal significance for Redford and embodies the spirit of artistic exploration and natural beauty. The Sundance Institute aims to provide a nurturing and collaborative environment for artists, allowing them to develop their craft, expand their networks, and gain exposure to industry professionals. It offers a variety of programs and initiatives geared towards filmmakers, screenwriters, directors, and other creative individuals. One of the most prominent initiatives of the Sundance Institute is the Sundance Film Festival. It began in 1995 as the Utah United States Film Festival and eventually evolved into the event it is today. The festival serves as a platform to showcase independent films from around the world, highlighting unique storytelling and innovative filmmaking techniques. It has become a major cultural event, drawing industry professionals, film enthusiasts, and media attention. In addition to the Sundance Film Festival, the Sundance Institute offers year-round programs and labs that provide emerging filmmakers with the necessary resources and mentorship to develop their projects. These programs include the Feature Film Program, Documentary Film Program, and Theater Program, among others. Through workshops, mentorships, and financial support, the Institute helps filmmakers navigate the creative and practical challenges of bringing their visions to life. Furthermore, the Sundance Institute actively promotes diversity and inclusion in the film industry. It strives to amplify underrepresented voices and perspectives that often go unheard in mainstream cinema. Through initiatives like the Indigenous Program and the Women at Sundance Initiative, the Institute provides targeted support and resources for filmmakers from marginalized communities, fostering a more inclusive and representative film landscape. The Sundance Institute, under Redford's guidance and continued involvement, has become a vital force in the world of independent filmmaking. Its commitment to nurturing artistic talent, supporting diverse voices, and championing creative risk-taking has made a lasting impact on the industry. Many acclaimed filmmakers, such as Quentin Tarantino, Ava DuVernay, and Damien Chazelle, have emerged from the Sundance Institute's programs, attesting to its influence in shaping the future of cinema. Robert Redford's creation of the Sundance Institute reflects his deep belief in the power of independent storytelling and the transformative potential of the arts. Through this organization, he has provided a platform for artists to develop their voices, challenge conventions, and contribute to the cultural tapestry of cinema. The Sundance Institute stands as a testament to Redford's enduring legacy and his unwavering commitment to nurturing creativity 
and artistic expression. Now, it's time for today's subscriber pick. Take a look at who Robert Redford is married to today. The radiant and talented Sybil Saggers. Their relationship is proof to the power of love and shared passions. In a heartwarming picture, we see the couple embracing each other, radiating happiness and contentment. Redford and Sagger's love story began when they crossed paths at an art gallery. The connection was immediate, and their shared love for art and nature deepened their bond. Zaggers, an accomplished artist, brought a vibrant creative energy into Redford's life, complementing his own artistic pursuits. Their relationship is built on mutual respect, support, and a shared commitment to environmental activism. Together, they have dedicated themselves to raising awareness about the importance of protecting our planet, using their influence to inspire others to take action. In the picture, we see the joy and warmth that emanate from their embrace. It captures a moment of true connection and love, their smiles reflecting the depth of their affection. Their journey together is a reminder that love can be found even after heartbreak and that it can blossom into something beautiful and enduring. Robert Redford and Sybil Saggers serve as an inspiring example of a couple who have found solace and happiness in each other's arms. Their love story continues to unfold, reminding us that life's greatest treasures can often be discovered when we least expect them. Let us know your take on this image in the comment section. Environmental and Political Activism Beyond his achievements in the entertainment industry, Robert Redford has been a prominent advocate for environmental conservation and engaged in political activism throughout his career. Let's explore his contributions in these areas, which reflect his commitment to using his fame and platform for positive change. Robert Redford has been a vocal and passionate supporter of environmental causes for several decades. Recognizing the urgent need to address environmental issues, he has actively raised awareness and promoted sustainable practices. In 1975, Redford founded the nonprofit organization, the Natural Resources Defense Council. The Natural Resources Defense Council focuses on protecting the natural environment by advocating for policies that address climate change, preserve biodiversity, and safeguard clean air and water. Through his involvement with the Natural Resources Defense Council, Redford has played a crucial role in shaping environmental policies and raising public consciousness about environmental challenges. Furthermore, Redford has used his influence to highlight the importance of renewable energy and the need to transition away from fossil fuels. He has been a vocal proponent of clean energy solutions and has advocated for greater investment in renewable technologies. Robert Redford has also been actively engaged in political activism, using his platform to promote democratic values and social justice issues. He has been an outspoken critic of government policies that undermine civil liberties and environmental protections. Throughout his career, Redford has used his films as a means to address social and political issues. For example, in his directorial debut, Ordinary People, he explored the complexities of mental health and family dynamics shedding light on important social issues. Through the power of storytelling, Redford has sought to spark conversations and provoke thought on critical topics. Redford has also been involved in campaigns to encourage voter registration and participation in elections. He has emphasized the importance of civic engagement and urged citizens to exercise their democratic rights. In addition to his advocacy work, Redford has used his voice to support candidates and initiatives aligned with his values. He has made public endorsements of political candidates who champion environmental conservation, social justice, and progressive policies. Overall, Robert Redford's environmental and political activism demonstrates his commitment to using his fame and influence to effect positive change. He has actively worked to preserve the environment promote sustainable practices, and raise awareness about pressing environmental issues. Furthermore, he has been an advocate for democratic values and has sought to inspire civic engagement and social justice through his films and public statements. Redford's activism serves as an inspiration for others in the industry and beyond, highlighting the potential for celebrities to leverage their platforms for the greater good. Personal Life Robert Redford married Lola Van Wagenen in 1958. 
and together they had four children, Scott, Shauna, David, and Amy. Their marriage lasted for nearly three decades, and during that time, they navigated the joys and challenges of family life. Redford and Van Wagenen's relationship was known for its stability and commitment. They weathered the storms of fame and the demands of Redford's career while maintaining a strong bond. However, their marriage faced its share of difficulties and they eventually divorced in 1985. Despite the dissolution of their romantic relationship, they remained connected through their shared love for their children and maintained an amicable relationship. The Redford Van Wagenen family was characterized by a sense of privacy and a commitment to shielding their children from the glare of the spotlight. Redford and Van Wagenen made a conscious decision to raise their children away from the Hollywood limelight, providing them with a relatively normal upbringing. This commitment to maintaining a sense of normalcy reflected Redford's values and desire to protect his family from the trappings of fame. Following his divorce, take a look at who Robert Redford is married to today. It's no other than his long-term girlfriend, Sibyl Zagers, an artist from Germany. The couple eventually married in 2009, marking a new chapter in Redford's personal life. Their union has been characterized by shared artistic pursuits and a love for nature. Zagger's passion for environmental activism aligns with Redford's own dedication to conservation, further strengthening their connection. Throughout his life, Redford has demonstrated a deep commitment to his family. Despite the demands of his career, he has prioritized spending quality time with his children and being present in their lives. This commitment to family values has been evident in his efforts to shield them from the public eye and to create a sense of normalcy amidst the fame and success. You might wonder, what are some of the challenges that Robert Redford and Lola Van Wagenen faced during their marriage? Their love story captured the imagination of many. A Hollywood heartthrob and a beautiful young woman embarking on a journey of love and commitment. But behind the glitz and glamour of Robert Redford and Lola Van Wagenen's marriage, they faced a series of challenges that put their relationship to the test. As Redford's star ascended in the film industry, the demands of his career became increasingly burdensome for their marriage. The bright lights of Hollywood beckoned, pulling him into a whirlwind of fame and success. Endless hours on set, press junkets and public appearances strained the couple's time together. The relentless pursuit of his craft often meant prolonged separations, leaving Lola to navigate the complexities of their relationship on her own. Rumors of infidelity swirled around Redford, fueled by the prying eyes of the media and the insatiable hunger for scandal. Lola, standing steadfast by his side, faced the painful whispers and innuendos that threatened to unravel their love. Trust became a fragile thread, delicately tested by the relentless scrutiny of the public eye. Balancing personal and professional lives proved to be an intricate dance. Redford's passion for his art consumed him, leaving little room for the mundane aspects of daily life. Lola yearned for a deeper connection, a sense of togetherness that transcended the glimmer of Hollywood. Yet, as their individual aspirations grew, finding common ground became a challenge, as the demands of their respective pursuits tugged at the fabric of their relationship. As the years passed, they found themselves drifting on separate currents, their interests and priorities diverging. Lola's desire to make her mark in the world, to champion causes close to her heart, clashed with Redford's relentless pursuit of his own creative endeavors. The once united front began to splinter as the strains of their individual journeys threatened to pull them apart. Through it all, the pressures of stardom and the relentless scrutiny of the public eye placed immense strain on their bond. They were not immune to the challenges that fame can bring, its intoxicating allure and its suffocating weight. The constant spotlight, the intrusion into their private lives, tested the very foundation of their love. Yet, Despite these obstacles, their shared commitment to their children remained unwavering. They navigated the complexities of their marriage with grace, maintaining an amicable relationship even after their divorce. Their love may have weathered, but the deep respect and shared devotion they held for their family endured. Legacy and Impact 
Robert Redford, the charismatic actor and visionary filmmaker, has left an enduring legacy that reaches far beyond the silver screen. With his talent, passion, and commitment to making a difference, he has become a cultural icon whose impact resonates in the realms of film, environmental advocacy, and philanthropy. Let's delve into the captivating story of his legacy and the lasting impressions he has made. Picture this, a cinematic titan gracing the screen with his magnetic presence. Robert Redford's performances were nothing short of mesmerizing, captivating audiences with his naturalistic acting style and his ability to inhabit a multitude of unforgettable characters. From the charming Sundance Kid to the relentless reporter Bob Woodward, Redford breathed life into roles that have become etched in cinematic lore. His performances were not mere acts, but transformative experiences that left an indelible mark on the fabric of film history. But Redford's impact extends far beyond his on-screen brilliance. In a stroke of visionary genius, he founded the Sundance Institute, a haven for independent filmmakers and a breeding ground for artistic innovation. Through the Institute's programs, Redford provided aspiring filmmakers with the tools, mentorship, and support they needed to bring their creative visions to life. The Sundance Film Festival, the crown jewel of the Institute, emerged as a platform for these emerging voices, celebrating the art of storytelling in its purest form. It became a cinematic pilgrimage where filmmakers and film lovers alike gather to experience the magic of independent cinema, forging connections and igniting a cinematic revolution. But Redford's passions extended beyond the realm of film. A fervent advocate for the environment, he lent his voice and influence to the fight against climate change and the protection of our natural world. Through organizations like the Natural Resources Defense Council, he championed sustainable practices, raised awareness about environmental issues, and inspired others to join the cause. His commitment to renewable energy and preserving our planet's beauty has inspired a generation to take action, leaving an indelible imprint on the tapestry of environmental activism. Yet, Redford's impact does not end there. His philanthropic endeavors have touched countless lives, leaving a lasting legacy of compassion and social engagement. From supporting educational initiatives to championing social justice causes, he has used his fame and resources to uplift communities and create a more equitable world. Redford's dedication to making a positive difference in society has set an example for others in the entertainment industry urging them to use their platforms for the greater good. As we reflect on Robert Redford's legacy, we witness the power of a true cultural icon. His influence transcends boundaries, captivating hearts, and inspiring minds across generations. Through his extraordinary talent, environmental advocacy, and philanthropy, he has woven himself into the very fabric of our cultural landscape. Robert Redford, a name that evokes admiration, creativity, and a relentless pursuit of excellence, will continue to shine brightly as a beacon of inspiration for artists, activists, and dreamers around the world. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next one.